Good. That's what. Yeah. Because now we're transferring, we're transferring these things that I harvested from the past, from the, the past to the future. So that. So I can't pick up the tooth, but there's an X on it. Okay. And I've got a vacuum. I got a vacuum tube, dude. Vacuum it up. Move it. <laughs> just just vacuum it, man. Small. Just vacuum it up. The vacuum tube is way smaller than the tooth. I have a, a scalpel matches a glass. Yeah. And yeah. chalk. Yeah. 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 So is there any idea of what I do with this tooth? Um, hmm. Do, do you have any instructions or anything? Because my instructions are basically done. Nope. Okay. Um, power. Oh, uh, power resurrection tank is the next thing that we need to do. Yeah. Okay. So tell me what's that. What's that telling you? Oh, it's just, it's just a checklist. Okay, well, let's walk through it. Uh, I already went through all of them. So the last one was press and hold the down arrow button for 10 seconds. Oh, okay. Um, um, check the, check the like instruction screen. Yeah, I did, but it's, that's, I'm, it's, that's it. It's the person yeah. in the future turns switch and communicates pointers, but we did that. So I got those pointers that opened up the, do you have any more pointer stuff that you can change or? Like on my box, I've got. I, we still have to. We still have to transfer the blood and the flesh. Okay. Yeah. Um. In order to do that, I don't know. I. We need to find a. One of us has a puzzle. Yeah. I feel like it's you because I just had that, where I communicated. That um. Code to you. Okay. Well, there's a. I'll just kind of tell you what I see. Okay. There's um. Like a circle that looks like something inserts into it, and above it, there's a symbol. Like yeah. a circle with an X in it. Okay. It's the symbol above it. And that's above where the tooth is. I'll just kind of explain what I'm looking at here. So after I did the last puzzle, yeah. a door opened up and a gigantic tooth was inside. But I, I'm clicking on the tooth and nothing's happening. Okay. There was also a piece of chalk okay. in that uh, cubicle with the tooth. Okay. So I drag in the chalk. Uh, the, the tooth has an X on it. Okay. I'm dragging the chalk over to it, to the axe. It doesn't do anything. Okay. The cup, I've got a cup. It doesn't do anything. The scalpel doesn't can, do anything. Can the you use the chalk anything. to draw over the axe instead of just drawing, like dropping it onto there? Can you draw on it? No, it doesn't do anything. And then I have this vacuum tube thing that I can move around. Okay. But I move it over the, the tooth and it doesn't do anything. I, I'm moving it everywhere. It doesn't do anything. Now, I do have a... Let's see, there's like a Bunsen burner thing. Yes, the Bunsen okay. burner is is what the blood is in. And just so you know, too, I also have um, this like above the ear is a sort of noose almost uh, with like a ring attached to it. And I can raise and lower that using this little lever beside the ear. I don't know if that oh. gives you anything. Like when I was well, in... Um, I had like a, this little hanging doll in the closet. Oh, it's actually in this room still. Oh, it's not. I have a room. locker that I can't open. Okay, well, what's on that locker? That I can't. I can't open it. There's a key slot. It's a keyhole. So there's two different lockers. Okay. Next to each other. Now I lit this Bunsen burner because I've got the matches. Okay, good. And um, you're so on the right a track. Table, there's a table with uh, a like a beaker full of a green liquid. Okay. And there's three different places that beaker can be moved to, it looks okay. like. Uh, and then there's a, to the left of those three spots, there's another holder thing. And then above it, there's a, a, a like a screen that says coffee missing. Now I put the green liquid on top of the Bunsen burner and it's boiling. Kay. Oh, there we go. And I'm pouring it into the... Yeah, this is all you right now. I'm pouring it into the receptacle. Okay. But it's still saying coffee missing. I don't know what the hell that means. Oh, maybe I put, put this it, here. Put it into your inventory. Uh, there is no coffee anywhere. Okay. I've got a... I've got a mirror too here. I'm literally the radio. only able to look at this box, so I, I I think I'm only relaying stuff. I I can't explore or do anything. Um, go around the box. Is there anything like? 
So I've got on the box, I've got the two, uh, I've got like three, looks like three cylinders. The tooth is lit up because we're done that. Um, underneath okay. is the piano keys. Um, so we need to. Okay, so the tooth is considered to be completed. Yes. Entirely, it sounds like. Yeah. And above those three cylinders is an image of the like the the wasp or the moth or the whatever, right? That thing we were talking about earlier. Above the beaker with the blood in it, there's like a hose. And that hose runs into like a tube that goes to the other side of the box. And on that side, there's like something that will open once I can start getting this stuff out of the, out of the, like the blood will flow into some type of thing that I could probably open. There's like a panel on the top. There's a panel on the bottom. It kind of looks like I might need tools. Like there's like these bolts. One's a triangle bolt. I don't think, it, I don't know if that's relevant. Do you have, like, a, a rope position anywhere? Like, is there any type of rope that you can adjust or anything that's adjustable in your side? Just that uh, that vacuum tube is kind of like a, a dangling rope. Okay. Can you, can you adjust um, its positioning or something? Yeah, but I'm moving it around and it doesn't do anything. Because I can adjust this rope to any position between top and bottom. But I don't know if that matters. Looks like it's supposed to pick something up. But, hmm. Okay. I can adjust this stool. That doesn't make any difference. I can't. Like, I'm using everything on everything to try to figure out what to do. Do you have any codes that you can give me? Like, do you have any new codes that popped up in the one, two, three, X, Y, Z? Um, anything on, just like, the Z one X two three Y, but I think you already put that in. Z one X two three Y. Yeah. I think I gave you that Oops, at the start. I did it wrong. Z one X two three Y. It's moving. Okay, yeah. So this it's the same thing. Um, but hold on. In this room, I have a code that I can sort of see on the picture frame. Okay. Y three X one Z two. Hold on. Maybe it's me. Oh, yeah, that's doing something. Yes, okay. Okay, okay, cool. Okay. It's now, just the way that it worked before is you seemed to give instructions, or I was giving instructions to you. Yeah. And then that was giving you more things to do in your... It was kind of back and forth. Exactly. Yeah. Um. So what does it say now? So now I've got a maze. And the number numbers 1, 2, and 3 are placed in different locations within this maze. It's on a grid of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven by seven grid. Seven by seven grid. And maze like walls along in here somewhere. Do you have anything like that? Looking around. That's cool that that, that came from there. I don't Maybe I have any, to open this up. I don't have any other codes in here. I, I have a feeling so there's like a panel that hasn't opened yet, and it's above that circular thing where I can insert something. Okay. And then above that is a circle with, with a cross in it. Do you have any other like do you have any um any other red, white, black circle things that we could put into positions around that lens? That hasn't changed, no. So I've, been, I've been clicking around that area. So it's still and black, has there. left, white, bottom, red, right? Yeah, that, that hasn't changed. Because there is another there's, compartment there's little... there that can open, so. Um, yeah, it's got to be something to do with this maze. Seven by seven. Seven so by say, seven just, squares. Just describe it again. Yeah, seven by seven squares. Um, there's solid black lines all the way around the outside, and then it's sort of like in this mazy shape and the there's um the, the numbers one two and three in different sections of the maze that i presume i need to communicate to you to tell you where so, these are hmm. yeah I or don't. maybe i'm navigate like are you able to move around the room anyway? yeah I can, I can move from like one wall to another okay but there isn't really uh movement like i can move through a no maze. no yeah. i have a feeling i have to get this open but i just don't know C communicate it to me what you're trying to open Show, tell me what's on there. So um, on one wall, there's there's like um, 
from floor to ceiling, there's like a metallic uh, rectangular thing. At the bottom of it is where that the uh, compartment where the tooth opened. And then above it, there's another compartment that looks like it's going to open up. And then below that, there's that circular thing that I need to insert something into. What's in your inventory? With, so I've got chalk. I've got a glass. I've got a scalpel and matches. And I've I've dragged everything onto that. Okay, so that's obviously not it. Is, do you have any place in there that you can set something down into and then perhaps combine within there? Like I had to set my soup uh, onto like in a from a pot onto the top of the radiator and then from there into the bowl and then use the spoon on the bowl to drink it kind of thing. Mm. Yeah, maybe maybe this this area where the beaker is. But I'm I can't set anything down on the spots. It still says coffee missing. I have no freaking idea what that means. Coffee missing? That's yeah. gotta be on you. I don't have anything like that. I've got drawers that I could open and close, but there's nothing in the drawers. I already got, I think, the scalpel from there. There's a mirror that's I can't Oh! What? It's a blackboard. <laughs> okay. So it's not a mirror, it's a blackboard? It's not a mirror, it's a blackboard. All right. All right, we're back on track. <sighs> wow. Okay. Uh, so I've got a bunch of symbols. Yep. Uh, it's, first of all, in the bottom, they're arranged in a grid. Yep. Is it a 7 by 7 left. grid by chance? <laughs> it's a... Uh, Is it a 7 by, by 7 grid? No, it's it's, it's 6 by 3. Oh, that's all. But there's a code, X3Z1Y2. Okay, so we're going to go to that because apparently I'm ahead then with that clue in my room, which is probably, very yeah. Okay. This is probably going to unlock X, that y, Z. thing that's going to be the maze. 1, yeah. 3, 2. Uh, sorry, X, 3, Z. Yeah. 1, Y, 2. Okay. When I lay in my coffin and my eyes become white, my soul will turn black. Use the cube to connect to the future. Bring me blood, flesh, and bone. Blood, flesh. Bone, flesh, and blood. Coffin is underlined. Eyes are underlined. Soul is underlined. Cube is underlined. Future is underlined. Bone, flesh, and blood underlined. Okay, so what I see is, uh, um, like I said, a six by three grid of symbols. Oh, hold on. I've got a wasp floating around here. <laughs> Wait, in real life? No, it's floating <laughs> around the box. He's just circling. Squ so I guess that's what that symbol was. Squaring so the block. What? Okay, but I don't have anything to. Now he's done. Now he stopped. Oh, I can I can circle some of these symbols. So I probably have to circle the ones that you that were underlined. Maybe. So circle. Do you have coffin? Yeah, we got coffin, and then you said eyes. Eyes. What was the other one? Soul. The black soul. My soul will turn black. Yep. Eyes okay. become white. So do you have white eyes? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. White eyes is is circled. So I've got I've got coffin yeah. circled in the top row. Okay. White eyes in the second row. Okay. And then there's the black. There's the what we've been seeing the limbo guy in the bottom row circled. Okay. Then there's more words underlined. Okay. Keep going. Cube. Yep. Future. And future. What's future? I don't know. So it's to connect to the future. Do you have like a computer <laughs> oh, or something? Oh, uh, there's a clock with a... Like a digital clock or something? Like a like like a clockwise arrow going around it. So that's oh, probably yeah. future. Okay. Yeah. And, then and then what's the... Bone, flesh, blood, all individually underlined. Bone, flesh, blood. Tell me that works. Okay, there's a hammer in the bottom right that's moving now. Oh, okay. I guess I click on that. Okay. Oh, it just created a hammer. Sick. <laughs> Okay. okay. The wasp is on my box now. Cool. What am I going to do with this hammer? Smash something. Yeah. You're going to smash something that will probably give you another code for instructions. Now, there is another uh, mirror here where I could see myself. Smash I have a very it. very unhappy look on my smash face. It. I'm going to smash it. No, it doesn't do anything. Hmm. Smash a chalk. No. Come on, Locke. Smash the machine. Start thinking. Start thinking. I'm smashing all the things that, that's smashable. Any instructions at all on your end? No. I, you you give me a code, and then I give you instructions. That's what we do. 
So that hammer Smash. obviously is going to do something. Smash. I tried smashing the vat. Smash oh, the Well, I can hammer. touch the... Interesting. He's like trying to get in here. Oh, smash the tooth. Yeah. There you go. It broke into pieces. Okay. Oh, now I can vacuum it up. There you go. Okay. Ah, uh, so now that thing closed the compartment. Okay. It's moving the tooth over. There we go. Bone is now, so I've got um, below the um, red, white, and black beetles that I was giving to you. There's three switches, one for bone, one for flesh, and one for blood, and the bone light has, is lit. Okay, good. And I've selected it. It's added the bones to the limbo, dude. Good. He's coming together. And now I've got new uh, needles. Okay, hit me with needles. Okay, red to the left. Yeah. White is to the left of top. Yeah. Black is all the way right. Okay. Now so we're going. Now I'm seeing limbo, dude, above me again. Oh. Black rat's back. And he's got the bones coming in. He's got the skeleton. So we're making progress. This is oh, good. I found a little hole in the uh, in the wall here and the little rat's peeking out. Oh, I found okay, something. Okay. I got the key. Okay, great. And I got, I got a nut driver. I knew I needed a tool. Okay, that's probably why the bee was on this thing. Yep. I'm, un I'm unscrewing something. Okay. Okay, I'm unscrewing a bunch of things on the side of this box. So hold on. That's I'm opening two. up the locker. That's three. I've got plans for the cubicle device, 1926. <laughs> okay, I've got a bunch of cogs and gears that yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll need to connect. Does that resonate with something you, you I got see? you here. Yeah, th this is like blueprints for the cubicle device, and I see cog positions. Okay, yeah. So number one is uh, you, you've got, you have a compartment with like a flask in it. Uh... There's, so it's... Okay, it says side A. It's three different compartments. Yep. One is flask. Takes up most of the right side. Yeah, that's where the ear is right now. Yeah, so the ear side. Yep. So the first cog is on the left side of that in the middle. Okay, here's left the side of the whole of the whole side. Here's the problem. Inside yep. these cogs, I can only rotate one and it just rotates essentially on its own. So I need to find more cogs before we do this because i got okay. spots that cogs will go so on so for side b they, there's like a picture of three different compartments one like all like in a vertical arrangement yep 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 the bottom one has cogs? a bunch of cogs that's yes. yeah so that's great okay. i have that i have that opened yeah there's also a, a compartment at the top but i need another tool for that and go to the other side what do you see you said there's three um, sides. There's only two here. I thought you said there was in the three. plants. No, no, no. There's three uh, compartments. There's three compartments on each side. Okay. Uh, let me see what else is here. There's also a, a computer. Yeah. Press down button when the person in the past found missing gears in hidden compartments. Yeah. So I think. Oh, okay. Well, I think I found the missing gears, but like I'm, I looks like there could be more gears. So it's not that you're placing the gears in those spots. Those are hidden compartments where the gears are. Yes. Okay. Okay. So the the first one you found, I guess, in yep. the, on the left side of side A. Yep. The, with the uh, the ear the, at the bottom. So no, no, above, no. Above. I didn't okay. find any gears in the ear side. Okay. No. So it says that they're hidden compartments that have the gears in them. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so the first one, like I said, was on the left hand side of that of the ear. Okay. Uh, side. I don't know if there's anything you can mess around with, like to open. On the like left hand side of the ear open. side, there's two additional compartments. Okay, um, so then to the left of that, like right yes. along the side. Yep, yep. Is there anything you can interact with? Can you slide it? Can you click on yeah, it? Yeah, I can rotate one gear, but as, uh, okay. as much as I rotate it, it just swings back to the same position. Now, what about above the ear compartment at, on the top of the box? Is there anything there? It says there's another hidden compartment with, with a, a gear in it. Um, no, I can't access that. I need a tool. So we need to unlock oh, okay. something else. Either you okay. need to give me new positions uh, of the red, white, and black, or new codes, or if you have that 7x7 seven seven grid maze situation, um, I can switch us back to that. But otherwise, there's nothing that I have access to here. Okay, so I found the coffee maker. Yeah. 
That's also in the locker. That seems like it was important before. Yeah, well, I didn't I didn't get to that yet. Okay. So there's a red button that I can use to like something's popping up okay. out of the top. Okay. And then there's a uh, a meter. Okay. So it's one, two, three, four, five notches on the meter. Okay. That doesn't. And it's between the. Doesn't do anything for me. Fourth and fifth. Is that is that anything? Uh, no, not right now. It's not. Could be for okay. later. Okay. So maybe I need to. I don't have the key for the other side of the locker. What was the? Didn't you have a checklist that was something about making coffee? Yeah, I, this thing is saying coffee missing. So get the coffee. Uh, or you there's need, no is coffee. That what, okay. There's no coffee in <laughs> the uh, machine. Okay. And the power button doesn't seem to be making it. Uh, maybe I need to like pour some water into yeah. it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make coffee, man. There is a uh, a sink here. Uh huh. But I. Oh, there we go. There we go. I filled the glass with water, so I Good tried. Boy. I tried. Uh... <laughs> Good boy. All right, shut the fuck up. <laughs> I I touched this three times before it didn't do anything. This time I hit it three times in a row, and the water turned on. Oh, weird. Yeah. Uh, all right, so <laughs> add this to the coffee maker. Yeah. Maybe I need. No, that does the water doesn't do anything. Maybe I need to heat it up. I put it down, uh, the water, the glass of the water I put down on a table, uh, where there's three different spots for liquids. So I guess I need to just put the coffee in the third spot. This is freaking weird. I don't know how I would make the coffee. Maybe my, maybe I can turn my gear here to grind coffee beans. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let me keep looking around. Keep I can't looking interact with any of the other gears in here. Oh, the rat's moving now. I'm Maybe probably going to gonna... find those in all these compartments that you've talked about. I'm going to find the other gears and then link them up and then open something. Probably, yeah. But you need the tools to be able to open them, right? Yeah, and I need codes from you to give you new instructions. Hmm. So it's either... Either that one, two, three, X, Y, Z, or the red, white, black. Oh, there's a number on the my cube. It says three. Three? Yeah. Three, two, one. It just blew up. What? <laughs> <laughs> I typed in three, two, one. I did not blow up. No. <laughs> so I kept hitting the right arrow. It did a countdown, and then the machine blew up. Great. Now I have some some dark powder, which I assume is coffee. Coffee, get it going. Make makes sense, right? Yeah, yeah, it totally makes sense. <laughs> okay, God, I can't wait I to got, watch I'm... what you're doing because I am so <laughs> it, it is, confused. It is so weird. I bet it's okay not. now. Now it's saying flesh missing. Yeah. Okay. So I, the computer just exploded and turned into coffee. Is that not weird? That's the definition of weird. No, that's normal. Okay, so we're working on the flesh thing. I'm going to yes. get, like, a hook that's going to attach to this lever that's going to lift up the ear, I think. So I can boil these three different substances. Boil away. Give me some something to work with over here. I'm dying. And I, I, I poured them into the receptacle and nothing happened. It's just saying flesh missing. So I guess I need to find the flesh and put it in there. Yeah. And then pour the three things. Yeah. So you're it. you're probably ahead of what we need to be doing because I can't get the Press flesh to you. Go to those side instructions. Of yeah, on side A, there's three compartments that you can obviously see, right? Yes. There's the one with the ear, there's the one with the chemicals, and there's one with, like, a slider. Yes. There's two other hidden compartments. Within that same side? On that side, yeah. Okay. So one of them is above where the, the ear compartment is, and it's along the top. Oh! It, like, yeah. <laughs> See, this is where we. This is where the miscommunication was. Yes, you were saying I need a tool to open that, and I was like, okay, I don't know, it doesn't say okay. anything like that here. Yeah, well, okay, because yeah. I don't think and we. I, 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 I don't think to we say, defined like, that there was an is, edge, but yes, I got it. I got a cube. Could slide on the edge. Okay, I got okay, a gear. Okay, good. Okay, okay good. and then yes, I see like the segments here. Okay, so I got the other gear. Okay, now okay. we're flying. Now we're in business. Okay, good, 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 good. And and okay. then on side B, there's I, another one in the top left. I see it. Okay, yeah, it's so clear now. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> okay okay so now i got the okay. three gears we're gonna toss yeah. these in now i just rotate this a bunch or i have no idea what to do after that yeah yeah i just rotated a bunch it's doing something it brought down that okay. creepy doll that i've been telling you about and it's got okay, a hook good. 
So I can probably... Oh, how do I get this doll off of here? Oh, so now I, got, I, can I, press... I knocked the doll down. I got the hook. Yes, nice. okay. So that, I was correct about the hook. So now I have to press the down button when the person in the past found missing gears and hidden compartments. Yeah. And now I've hooked now on there's the a ear, hook. and I'm lifting it up. Okay. And I'm taking it out, and I think it's going to send to you. Great. Yep. Okay, yes. I really yes. need an ear. <laughs> okay, you've got the ear, and now that ear has been replaced with uh, what I imagine is your your um, furnace slider positions, but they're they're uh, vertical and not horizontal. Okay. You, but I have the furnace in here, and I can see... Well, but it's... Yeah, I can see. I, uh, so the computer has a symbol. Okay. Uh, three symbols. There's a hook, an ear, and then I've got three sliders that ha show positions. Yeah, tell me those. Yeah. So there's uh, the sec... The leftmost one is uh, one from the bottom. Okay. The second position for the bottom. The second one is the topmost position. Yeah. The third one is the middle position. Okay, now I have a code for you. Okay. Left, up, up, down, left, up. Left, up, up, down, up, up? Left. So left, up, up, down, left, up. Left, up. Okay. Yeah. I inputted that. Okay. And now I've got 7 by 7 grid. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So now i got to put this And I've got a code. I've got a code, too. Yeah. Probably Y3X1Z2. Yeah. You got it. Yeah. I already had that in my room. Y3X1Z2. All right. Was it the same code as the one that I gave you from the... Uh, yes, it was behind board? that painting. Oh. Yeah, okay. that's interesting. Okay. So I've got a hook in the top left gri most grid. Okay. I don't know what that means. Me neither. Oh, you, I have to navigate a maze, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay, so, so I think I have to use these directional pads to move the hook around. Oh, okay. So that code that I gave you, that left up, up, down, left up, that unlocked this, right? Exactly. Okay, so I can navigate you to get these different items, I think. Okay. You, you just need to tell me where you are in the grid. So I'm in the top left. Furthest top left? Yeah. Okay, so you're going to go to the middle top. Okay. Then go to the middle of the whole grid, like just down. Yeah. So you're right in the middle of the grid. Go to the right twice. Yeah. Up twice. Yeah. Right once. Yeah. Down twice. Yeah. Okay, I got one of, I've got three rectangles in the top left next to the grid. One of them is, is... I picked up some. <laughs> okay, sweet. So from yeah. there you're in that same position? Yeah. Up twice. Yeah. Left once. Huh? Down twice. Got it. Left twice. Okay. Up twice. Yeah. Left one. Yeah. Now from there, go to the bottom, except not all the way. Just one above the bottom in that third row. Got it. Then go three to the right. One, two, three. Yeah. Down. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Up, up. And that should okay, be the I got another one. thing. Okay. Yeah. Now nope. down twice. Mm -hmm. Left. Just once? Yep. Okay. Up. Once? Left three times. Good. Yeah, it'll be once if I don't say a number. Okay. Down. Left twice. Yeah. Up four times. So you should be on the yeah. third row. Yeah. Right. Once. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Down one, two, three times. Boom. There got all go. three. Okay. Sweet. Now we're. So I've got a. Uh... I've got a, like a really low res image of a room and a, an ear. Oh my god, the dude's in the room. Dropped. The dude's in the room staring at me. Holy so shit. So an ear is dropped down from the ceiling. Yep, there you go. On a rope. Now we just need to figure out the blood. Okay, but is this my room or is that your room? Well, I'm not sure. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I can't. <laughs>